got the sum of two functions. F of x equal to x minus 4. G of x equal to x plus 6. And they're asking us to find... Find f plus g of the number negative 4. A couple of ways of doing this. I'm going to stick to the most basic way and not introduce anything different at this stage. Basic way of doing this is to find f of negative 4. Then you're going to add g of whatever negative 4 is. So we need to evaluate both of these and then add the answer. Let's see, f of negative 4 in the f function, I'm going to replace x with negative 4. So this is negative 4 minus 4. Negative 4 combined with a negative 4 is a negative 8. Then I'm going to calculate g of negative 4. So in place of x here, I'm going to substitute a negative 4, add 6, and I'm going to get a positive 2. So I'm going to take a... Negative 8, f of negative 4, and I'm going to add to that, since the function says add, negative 8, add whatever g of negative 4 was, which is 2, and I get a negative 6, and as you can see, that's letter B on the exam. Number 16. No, I guess I ought to go to 15 before I get to 16. Alright, cut me some slack on these videos because they're not going to be absolutely perfect. I'm going to make some boo 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 so. And again, yeah. Number 15, f of x defined as 2x minus 8. And g of x defined as 6x minus 7. And what he's asking me here is to take f minus g of x. What this translates to is f of x minus g of x, just the way it's written. The f function is first, second function is g, and you're asked to subtract these two. What is the f of x function? It's right here. It's 2x minus 8. Here's the deal. You're subtracting, you're subtracting a polynomial. It's got two terms. You're subtracting g of x. What you need to do is put that in parentheses. And the reason being is that this minus sign is going to affect both these terms within the parenthesis. This gives you 2x minus 8 minus 6x plus 7. A negative times a negative is a positive. Combining like terms here, you end up with a negative 4x minus 8 and a positive 7 is a minus 1. And as you can see, it's... Answer A. Number 16. F of X is defined as 7X minus 4. And G of X is defined as 4X plus 1. And what is he asking us in 16? He wants us to find the product. F, G. Notice there's no dot here, but you could put one. F times G of X, which translates to F of X times G of X. The F of F function is 7X minus 4 times the G of X function, 4X plus 1. This is your basic FOIL problem. 7X times 4X, 28X squared. Up top, the outside terms, 7X times a positive 1 is a positive 7X. Minus 4 times 4x minus 16x, and a minus 4 times a positive 1 is a negative 4. Combining like terms, you're going to get 28x squared minus 9x minus 4. As you can see, this is letter C on the exam. Number 18. Well, if I could count, I'd be really good. I'd be a math teacher. Because after 16 comes 17. All 